serene and peaceful in the world's busiest harbor, when suddenly... <laughs> what mad fiend is at work here? Who is the mysterious ship sinker? You have three guesses. You go or go-go? No fair, you peep. This is the way we sink the ships, rob the ships and sink the ships. dum dee dee dum dee dum dee dum dum dee dum dee dum A hurried call for assistance goes to Batfink in his split-level cave. The hotline. Batfink here. Batfink? The underworld has gone underwater. Either Lloyd Bridges has finally flipped, or it's the work of... You go a go-go. Leave it to Karate and me, Chief. Karate, the battle act. A button down the hatches and belay the poop deck. Great plan you've got, Batfink. From underwater, this raft looks like the hull of a ship. Now, if it only fools Hugo Agogo. What's this? Another ship to rob? Oh, the work of a crooked mad scientist is never done. Poor Hugo, I'm always on the go-go. You relax, Batfink. With me as your lookout, you don't have a thing to worry about. Except falling through a hole in the deck. A hole in the deck? Batfink, out cold. I'm sinking. Must lighten the ship and plug the hole. I'm being towed by the submarine. I know what I'll do. I'll sit here and be towed by the submarine. So glad you dropped in, Batfink. I need some harpoon practice. You fiend. <laughs> I'm not hungry. I'm feeding you to the shark. He's hungry. Not even a shark can penetrate my wings of steel. I've got you at last, Hugo Agogo. Frank, you all right? He was. Don't make a move, Batfink, or Karate gets it. And I don't have wings of steel. Sorry about this, Batfink. Ready, aim, fire! The torpedo heads for a Batfink bullseye. This time it looks like our heroes are really sunk. <laughs> Congratulations, Batfink! We got them all! The octopus saved our lives. See if the DA can give him a helping hand. Eight helping hands. A fabulously swank jewelry shop owned by glamorous ZZ Mama Hubbard. Mama is going to the opening of that fantastic new Hungarian delicatessen, darling. So I'll wear all of my jewels. Let's see what Mama Hubbard has in her cupboard. The cupboard is bare. I've been robbed. Oh, how chic. Meanwhile, Batfink, nemesis of evildoers, is relaxing in his split-level cave with his assistant, Karate. Don't hurt yourself, Karate. This hand is like steel, Batfink. I can't hurt it. But this hand, I can't. Oh! The hotline. Batfink here. A bizarre robbery at Mama Hubbard's, Batfink. 
Our only clue is this note the villain left behind to taunt us. I'll shoot it to you through the chute. Old Mama Hubbard went to the cupboard to put on her diamonds and rubies. But when she got there, the cupboard was bare. Brother Goose says the police are just boobies. What do you think, Batfink? Well, Chief, it rhymes. <laughs> On the outskirts of town at an abandoned amusement park. Uh, down with Mother Goose, up with Brother Goose. She made up rhymes, I make up crimes. Ho, ho, ho. My supersonic sonar radar will locate Brother Goose's hideout. The uh, bat thinks beeps. He's found me fast. No matter, this case is Batfink's last. Huh? 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 A note from me. Like Little Jack Horner, sit in the corner to eat your Christmas pie. Stick in your palm and pull out a bar. Goodbye, karate, goodbye. Somehow that doesn't sound right. Hmm. Humpty Dumpty sat on a wall. The Humpty Dumpty had a great fall. That Humpty Dumpty I won't even feel. You forgot my wings are a shield of steel. The curses, he rhymes too. Jack be nimble, Jack be quick. Try and take care of this candlestick. And bad things, you can't break through the bars. They're plutonium. <laughs> Hi, diddle daddle, it's time to skedaddle while you blow as high as the moon. Aren't you even gonna try to help me? What's going on here? This can't be! Hero at Bad Thing turned coward, leaving Karate to face his doom with a boom! Jack and Jill went up the hill to fetch a pail of water. Jack came down and broke his crown. And Brother Goose came tumbling Otter. Otter? Well, after doesn't rhyme, that drink. In this tiny alley begins one of Batfink's strangest adventures. You wait here, Larry. I'll throw the Wombly Diamond out that window. You catch it, we're rich. Yeah, yeah. Sure, sure, Harry. Come on, Harry, babe. Chuck it in there, Harry, Harry, baby boy. Go to bed, Harry, baby. Go sit in there, baby boy. The Wombly Diamond is gone. Search me. Okay, where is it? Did you know that diamonds bounce? The candy factory? The diamond's been made into a chocolate-covered candy bar. Meanwhile, in Batfink split-level cave... The hotline. Batfink here. Batfink, the Wombly Diamond has mysteriously disappeared. And somebody just stole your candy bar. Batfink, somebody just stole my candy bar. We just got a dozen reports. Somebody's stealing candy bars all over the city. That can wait, Chief. I'm going after the Wombly Diamond first. My supersonic sonar radar can help me. 
Good. Everybody's left the factory. The diamond wasn't in the candy bars we stole. It must still be here. Search everything. I found something. I found something. What is it? What is it? A chocolate-covered beep with almonds. That's Batfink's supersonic sonar radar. We've got to work fast. Someone's taken a bite of my chocolate-covered beep. Karate, I think we're going to solve two cases at one time. To the candy factory, quick! I was expecting you, Batfink. Bullets cannot harm me. My wings are like a shield of steel. Oh, yeah? You know something, Harry? What, Larry? Bullets cannot harm him. His wings are like a shield of steel. Some peanuts and a little coconut. Huh, a bat thing bar. Not even your wings of steel can save you from the plutonium blade of the cutting machine, Bat Fink. Will Bat Fink be cut into bite-sized chunks of tasty goodness? Is this the end of our candy-coated crime fighter? Your wings of steel did save you. No. The only thing hard enough to shatter the plutonium blade was the Wombly Diamond. My supersonic sonar radar located it in the vat of chocolate. Licorice. <laughs> Karate, how did you get out of the caramel? I ate myself out. I love caramel. <laughs> <laughs>